Sigma empaths may seem carefree on the outside due to their chill and passive nature, but they hide numerous problems and struggles behind their innocent, calm, and poker faces. Since they are known as the lone wolf among other empaths, they enjoy self-company and can survive without other people's assistance. In addition, they are the most mysterious type in the empath's tribe because they prefer to live a low-key and private life. Some people think Sigma empaths live life easily because they never see them ask for help from others or act all dramatic over their problems. However, they have struggles we know nothing about because they seem to handle life easily. Watch until the end as I show you 10 reasons why it is hard to be a Sigma empath. Number 1. People often misunderstand Sigma empaths. Due to Sigma empaths' reserved, passive, and private nature, people often misunderstand them. They do certain things that seem weird to most people. However, due to their carefree character, they do not bother explaining themselves to others because they believe it will only waste their time and energy. Since Sigma empaths are not afraid to be different, they do not mind what other people say about them. They do not need other people's understanding because they understand themselves. Number 2. People often think Sigma empaths are okay. Sigma empaths are psychologically strong and emotionally independent. They can handle their emotions well, especially in public. Because of that, people often think they are always okay. Sigma empaths prefer not to tell others about their problems because they want to keep the details of their lives as private as possible. In addition, they are selective when it comes to peers and do not easily give their trust to others. Sigma empaths protect their privacy at all costs, and only a few trusted people know about their struggles in life. Number 3. People often judge Sigma empaths as antisocial. Sigma empaths are introverted individuals. They find peace, comfort, and enjoyment in self-company. Although they know how to socialize well with others, they still prefer to be alone most of the time. Dealing with other people with various types of personalities can drain Sigma empaths' energy. They constantly need to withdraw from people and spend time with themselves to recharge their emotional batteries. Sigma empaths prefer to travel alone, away from the city and closer to nature. The trees, hills, falls, forests, and sea offer them peace of mind that most humans can provide. People often judge them as antisocial because of their introverted and reserved nature. Number 4. Sigma empaths can maintain a cool temperament amid arguments. Super empaths do their best to avoid social conflicts because they do not want to waste their time and energy on arguments and dramas. They dislike emotionally evoking conversations and activities because they strive to maintain their composure in front of other people. When someone challenges them to a debate, Sigma empaths will most likely disengage and walk out of the scene even though they can silence and humiliate their challenger in public to deflate their egos. For most people, it is hard to keep calm amid arguments. However, Sigma empaths can easily maintain their passive nature during social conflicts by showing their poker faces. Number 5. Some Sigma empaths end up being single forever. Since Sigma empaths are emotionally independent, they do not need someone to make them happy. In addition, they take full responsibility for their sadness by comforting themselves through self-care routines. Sigma empaths do not expect someone to take good care of them because they do it better. They do not seek genuine love from others because they have it in themselves. They do not need a lover to tell them they are worthy as a person. Most of all, they know how to validate their share of thoughts and emotions, which most couples fail to do with their romantic partners. Number 6. Sigma empaths have challenges finding true friends. Since Sigma empaths are introverted, they have challenges searching for trusted people who should enter their lives. They keep their circle of friends as small as possible because they are more concerned with quality over quantity in their friendships. Sigma empaths tend to be picky regarding peers because they believe that everyone they allow 
will significantly impact their mental health and overall well-being. With that, they filter and select people who deserve to become a part of their lives. Some people judge them for being picky when it comes to friendships. However, they cannot blame Signal Empaths because they can choose the people worthy to be on the pages of their life stories. Number 7. Sigma Empaths do not register themselves with any social groups. Sigma Empaths do not conform to stereotypes. Thus, they do not want to join social groups such as fraternities that promise loyalty, camaraderie, and support. Sigma Empaths have strong core identities and do not need to be a part of a group to validate themselves and other companions. Sigma Empaths are confident with themselves but prefer to be low key. They take pride and refuge in the love, validation, understanding, faith, and support they can provide to themselves. Other people think Sigma Empaths are lonely, hopeless, and helpless because they do not register themselves with any brotherhood or sisterhood. However, Sigma Empaths are more than happy, secured, and contented with self-company due to their self-sufficient nature. Number 8. Sigma Empaths often get judged by others as killjoys. Sigma Empaths are busy individuals because most of them are workaholics. They prefer to overindulge themselves with their work clothes, even past their working hours and partying in a nightclub. Other people, especially their colleagues, think they are lonely, boring, and killjoys. However, that is not true. Sigma Empaths are fun to be with because of their unique sense of humor, which only a few people can understand. Just because they often decline invitations to hang out in nightclubs does not mean they are killjoys. Crowdy and noisy places are not just Sigma Empaths thing. They prefer to save their time and energy on more important things. Number 9. Sigma Empaths do not have other support systems aside from themselves. Since Sigma Empaths are known for their self-sufficient nature, they get used to the idea that no one will be there to help them in times of crises except themselves. No matter how strong and independent Sigma Empaths are, they need other support systems aside from themselves. However, Sigma Empaths do not want to add up to other people's problems. With that, they prefer to keep their struggles to themselves and find ways to solve them. Instead of running toward other people to ask for help regarding their dilemmas, they turn to nature to meditate and recharge their emotional batteries. Number 10. People want to intrude Sigma Empaths' private lives. Sigma Empaths are intrigued about how this rare breed of empath can maintain their calm and chill temperaments amid conflicts and trials. Since Sigma Empaths are mysterious individuals due to their private nature, other people are curious about the details of their lives. With that, many want to intrude on Sigma Empaths' privacy. Some are also envious of Sigma Empaths' humble achievements. Because of that, many people attempt to sabotage their success by invading their private lives and promoting smear campaigns against them. I will be asking you a series of questions answerable by yes or no. Do you have what it takes to become a Sigma Empath? Can you manage your temper and keep your composure when someone challenges you into a debate or duel? Can you work hard in silence and stay humble when you achieve your goals? Can you live a simple, peaceful, and low-key life? Can you be content with what you have? Can you appreciate the little things in life? Can you dare to be different without fear of getting judged and misunderstood? Can you survive and overcome your problems without asking for help from other people? Can you validate your share of thoughts and emotions? Can you see your worth even if others fail to acknowledge it? If your answer to this question is no, it only proves that it is hard to become a Sigma Empath. Leave a comment below, like this video, and subscribe to this channel. It helps us a lot. Take advantage of this exciting